I got a lot of my inspiration to run from my grandpa. He ran his whole life, even in his 80s, he ran on an Ultra G. He wasn't a racer, but he just loved the movement of running, and I feel like I got that from him. One day I was out on an eight mile run, and it was a loop, and I got about four miles out, and I just couldn't stay on my feet. And I had people stopping and asking me if I was okay. And then about a month later, I was running and I fell into traffic, into oncoming traffic. And I called my husband, I was like, there's something wrong with me. I went to see a neurologist, they got more serious, and I got in to see this movement specialist who diagnosed me with repetitive movement dystonia. And I was like, what is that? You know, I had no idea what it was. I had never heard of it. When it's really bad, it's like I come through and land, but I don't feel any of that feedback back that it landed. And it's so real that even though my foot has landed, my body will be like reacting as if it didn't land. You know, it's been hard to be told there's nothing you can do really. It's, it's forever and it might get worse, it might not. It's been, it's been awful, if I'm being honest. You know, I loved running before I knew I was good at it. I loved it after my competitive career was over. I love it just as much now as I did at any point in my life. I was trying to figure out like, who am I without running? Um, and I know it sounds so simple, but like, it's just running. But for me, it's not, it's literally my life. And I'm not, I'm not who I am without it. The Bachman Strauss Foundation for Dystonia Research actually reached out, they had someone that reached out to my husband when I was first diagnosed. And I didn't really want to speak to them yet. I didn't, I was still learning what dystonia was. I think it has opened my eyes that there is a community there, but we just haven't, you know, we're all kind of suffering in silence instead of coming together. Five dollars of every pair of the Hope colorway sold will go to the Bachman Strauss Foundation for Dystonia Research. I think when I see someone wearing the colorway, I'll probably freak out a little bit. It'll be pretty cool to see someone and to know that someone cared enough to buy that colorway and to, and to know where their money was going to help other people. That's pretty cool.